Next, I will briefly cover the goals that guided the development of the alternatives. Goals for Oceana revolve around the themes of land management, connectivity, habitation, and public well-being. Through land management, the planning team strives to increase the overall density of all uses, establish a concentrated downtown which offers mixed uses and commercial amenities, and set land aside for open space and conservation. The goals of connectivity are to improve pedestrian safety, establish bicycle and pedestrian paths and trails, and increase transportation connections between the inland and coastal areas of Oceano. The goal of the habitation theme is to foster a sense of place through equitable and affordable housing that maintains Oceano's small town feel. The goals surrounding public well-being include promoting access to healthy foods, commercial amenities, open space and recreational opportunities, and increased transportation alternatives. As a frame of reference for the three alternative scenarios, we divided Oceano into eight neighborhoods. These neighborhoods serve as the geographic guide for the three paths to the future that we'll present on. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go on. The Strand neighborhood is located on the western side of Oceano, surrounded by the Pacific Ocean and Oceano Lagoon. This area currently encompasses mostly residential uses with several vacant parcels. North of the Strand neighborhood is Pier Avenue. This neighborhood consists of commercial and residential land uses with a mix of open space and vacant parcels. It is also the main access point to the entrance of the Oceano Dunes SVRA. This area contains state park campgrounds and overlies the Oceano Lagoon. Next is the industrial neighborhood, which is intersected by Highway 1 and the railroad. This neighborhood is bordered by the Oceano County Airport and comprised mainly of industrial land uses with some commercial, residential, and vacant space. In the context of our plan, we have considered the airport parcel as its own neighborhood. Only one alternative team proposes changes in the airport. On the other side of Highway 1 is the downtown neighborhood. This neighborhood consists, exists with a blend of uses which include commercial, residential, mixed use, public facilities, and some vacant space. Next is the central neighborhood, which covers the largest geographic area of the community, consisting primarily of residential land uses with some public facilities and vacant land. The Oceano Elementary School and Oceano Community Center are in this area. Further east, we have the Halcyon neighborhood, which consists of residential and agricultural land uses. None of the alternative proposals will present changes to Halcyon in order to preserve the current character of this historic district. To the south of Highway 1, we've identified the southern neighborhood. This area is comprised of primarily residential land uses containing two mobile home parks and the Pismo Sands SVRA. Not SVRA, Pismo Sands RV Park. 